Hello, so today you find us out on a bit of a dreary day, a bit grey and cold and it's supposed to rain soon, but we're with, I'm happy because I'm with Macy, here she is, and Hugo, and Walty, and, and Louie joins us on the lunchtime today, don't you Lulu? So he's making some new friends, he never met Macy before, he's having a good old run around together. very interesting that um, when you're thinking of buying a dog or, or rescuing a dog it's really interesting and, and important to research the breed before you get one because as you can see the contrast in these guys we've got Louis who's an Irish setter we've got Macy who's a puggle so she's a pug cross with a beagle and then we've got the two cockapoos Walter and Hugo and uh, yeah if, if you um, get a dog or thinking about getting a dog make sure it fits into your family life your home life your work life because no matter what breed you get whether it be a Yorkie or a Chihuahua right up to a, a Irish Setter or a German Shepherd or a Doberman or something like that they're all going to need exercise and every breed is, is specific if I can say it <laughs> and um, yeah it's interesting to know what you're getting say with a Cockapoo you've got a Poodle in there but you've also got the Cocker Spaniel. Cocker Spaniels have got very high energy drive, highly intelligent, need their brains to be exercised as much as their physical needs. So, you know, Cockapoo, they're beautiful to look at, but they do need that exercise every day. Same with the Puggle, you've got the Beagle in them. So they've got the energy, they've got the drive to sniff everything out. Um, beagles are quite well known for um, not being great off lead because they do follow their noses and can chase the scent for miles. Obviously Macy's not like that, she's a great girl, stay with us. And then obviously, being a gun dog, he's uh, an Irish setter. He's nose to the ground a lot of the time, running around. This, this guy, as you know in my other videos, he just doesn't stop running. Louis the running man. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so he covers, when we come out, he covers miles because he's just running and running and crossing whole fields and back again. But his recall is fantastic, so I don't worry about that. But he always keeps me in check right now and comes back again. But just, yeah, when you're, if, if you know anyone who's thinking about getting a dog or rescuing a dog, make sure they research the breed. Make sure they know what they're buying into because it can create all sorts of um, behaviour issues if they're not stimulated enough at home, um, if they're not worked hard enough, not walks hard enough, some dogs are here only go out a couple of times a week, you know, that's, any dog needs to go out every day really, but um, yeah, just a really good idea to fully research the breed, because we can all love a breed and all fall in love with a breed, but it's the work that goes with it, and the, uh, the extra time you have to spend with certain breeds to make it work, so that's an important one I think.
so guys and me that's the end of our little time on our walk that you get a glimpse into hope you have a great day see you bye bye